that, uh, <coughs> excuse me, the power in the sea is the greatest of them all among the air, the land, and the sea. How? He said, in the head, about 75% of the space on earth is occupied with water. And now, if you will remember in the Bible, when the, uh, the when Jesus approached the spirit from the gatherings and um, the demon came to meet him and said, have you come to judge us before our time? He, now, he said, now, therefore, send us into the swine. Now from the swine, we will find our way. And Jesus cast them into the swine. And from the swine, they met themselves in the river. I tell you, there are powers in that river. There are a lot of powers in the air that are bound up with territorial demons. Like I told you the last other time, that these spirits are called demons. They are from the arms of the principalities. And it is when a spirit enters a body, before you can start call, uh, start to call them a witch, uh, before you can call them a wizard, before you can call them uh, the different spirit that bears different kind of name and, and, and all that. And so are you find these uh, powers in the sea. And you want to talk about the air, the powers in the air. Yeah. These are the ones that flies. They flies. These are the ones that oh, trap yeah. blessings. They flies. And, and now when they fly, they have the ability to connect, ability of connectivity. I, I have also said it here before mm. that uh, some of these yeah. spirits yeah. have the ability uh, 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 to to yeah. enter oh. into a bell and, and they can land oh. anywhere close to your house from there forming a channel. There is nothing you say in your house oh. that they don't hear. There is nothing you yeah. do that they don't hear. Yeah. And you, you, you also, these are powers that flies. They have their meetings. They meet in the dark. These are people that cause spirit together uh, and begin to gang together and begin to take uh, evil counsel uh, against people's life. And now, the power in the land. The power in the land, these are the ones that cause accidents. The power in the land, these are the ones that lives with us. These are the ones that demons are partnered with. And, and, and they call them a witch. They they, they look like our yeah. friends. They are very close to us. They come to our church. They put scarf in their mm. hair. They put cap in their hair. They wear good clothes, fine suits. I tell you, some of them even speak in tongues. Yeah. You see them. If you talk about prayer and fasting, they can do it more than you. I'm telling you. These are powers in the land. But I come to tell you that the power in the sea, the power in the land, the power in the air, Jesus' power greater than them all. Amen? Amen. Amen. And that's why he now said it in part B here. He said, an add dominion over the yeah. fish of the sea. That's the power in the sea. And have dominion over the power of the air. Those are the birds that flies. These are powers that rules the air. And over every living thing that moves upon the earth. Our prayer will take to the dimension tonight. And I tell you that in each of those dimensions, you will have victory. Amen. I just pray for you tonight. I said in each of those sections of prayer tonight, you will have victory. In the Amen. name of Jesus. I want you to bow down your head and begin to bless the name of the Lord because it is today, it is this very moment that God will answer your prayer. Open your mouth and begin to bless the name of the Lord. I want you to bless you. I want you to magnify him. I want you to glorify him. 
Please open your mouth and begin to bless the name of Jesus. Please open your mouth and begin to bless the name of Jesus. He is worthy of our praise. He is a great God, a powerful master. And he is here tonight. Lord, we bless you. Lord, we bless you. Holy Ghost, we bless you. Thank you, Father, for gift of life. Thank you for health and strength. Thank you because you are not far from us. Lord, I thank you for what we do today. I bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen. I want us to pray and tell the Lord. Father, I thank you. Bless I want to tell the Lord that whatever you. sin we have committed unknowingly. Let me quickly explain this thing to you because, you know, some of us, we feel that how will I commit a sin unknowingly? So let me quickly explain to you so that you will know that there are some sins that we, we commit. And that's why some people will just come and tell you that there is no how you can walk and your head will not shake. Well, that's not a format. And that is not a justification, I'm telling you. That does not justify anybody to commit sin. But look at this. What are the sins we commit that we don't know? May I quickly refer you to what uh, Moses did? Moses smote the rock with the rod in his hand. He never knew that that rock was God. Oh, Jesus. And so once he smote the rock out of anger and all that, he honored his name more than his word. And so the miracle happened, but God was angry. If Moses knew that that rock was God, would he have smote the rock? No. No. Amen. So Amen. this is a sin we commit unknowingly. And so we cannot be so self-righteous and say we are hundred percent and and all. and that act make God very angry that He asked God for forgiveness. Yes, God for forgave Him, but said you will not get to that land. We are going to pray and tell the Lord any sin I commit, knowingly oh or knowingly, that have been committed oh by me. Lord, I oh ask God. that you forgive. I ask oh that you God. pardon. In the name of Jesus, shall we open our mouth and pray? That thing that makes God angry, Lord, please, that I do, and I do not know that it makes you angry. Please, Lord, forgive me. Please, Lord, forgive me. The known one and the unknown one, the besetting sin, the one that is very hard to let go. Please, Lord, forgive me. Holy Ghost, forgive me. Holy Ghost, forgive me. Holy Ghost, forgive me. In the name of Jesus, whatever will be influenced on my prayer to the Lord, I knock it out. Lord, I destroy it. Lord, I knock it out. Lord, I destroy it. In the name of Jesus, I destroy it, Lord. I destroy it. 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 In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Amen. Power in the sea. I told you we were praying one day. And we were addressing spirits. And a woman speak through the person we were praying for. And he said, that person you are praying for, our glory has been buried. And that glory, where is it located? He said it's located under the grave that is in the sea. Under the grave that is in the sea. We are going to pray. Wherever my glory is being controlled by the sea, by the power in the name of Jesus, I reclaim it back now in the name of Jesus. Shall we open our mouth and pray? My God and my Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we have my glory. Now. I locate it back. I locate it back now in the name of Jesus. I don't see what they have done to what they have been doing. 
But in I know that through the, the blood, blood of Jesus, here, my through glory the power that is in the name of Jesus, I call my glory from the sea. I call my glory from under the earth. In the name of Jesus, I come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Let my glory locate me. Let my glory locate me. Let my glory locate me. Let it locate me. Let it locate me. Let it locate me. In the name of Jesus, look at me, 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 look at me. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We located a power when we were praying. And when we saw the act. So we knew that this one is a power from the sea. So we collaborated together and prayed and said, Lord, let the water begin to dry. And that demon speak out. He said, what do you mean by let the water begin to dry? If the water dry, where do you want me to go? <laughs> and where should they go now? If you go and die, any power that says you will not live, that your existence is making them afraid, your existence is their own problem, then God will eliminate them in the name of Jesus. Yes. We are going Amen. to pray and tell the Lord. Every power operating from the sea, wanting me dead, I command in the name of Jesus, let their water begin to dry up. Let it begin to dry up. Let you begin to dry up. Let you begin to dry up. Open your Holy mouth Spirit and pray. My Father and my God, all this power. Let their water, water begin to dry. Every power from the sea. Let their water begin to dry. Let from the river. Right Lord, let your water begin to dry. 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 Let your water my God and my Father, I command. Let the water dry up. 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 In the name of Jesus, I render their power powerless. In the name of Jesus, I render them helpless. Helpless. I'm powerless. In the name of Jesus, every power that says I do not deserve to live, my God and my Father, oh, you are saying dryness into their water. Let the water dry up. Let the water dry up. Let the water dry up. In the name of Jesus, every power from the water. my land. Let me I told you that that water occupies seventy five percent of the whole heart. And that is why they, are, they, they have so much power over the remaining of this being talked about put together. And when you get here, you go to this place, this is, this is the one of the most common power you will see. 
power of the sea. And let me tell you, as uh, Pharaoh began to show that he is God, after God had dealt with him and showed him wonders, nine times, ten times, and God said, I will arise. At the end of the day, the, 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 their enemy was drowned in the Red Sea. We are going yeah. to pray and tell the Lord, every power that lives in the sea, that multiply themselves because of me, they distribute power to themselves because of me. Lord, let them perish inside that water. Shall we open Amen. our mouth and pray? Let Father, them in the mighty name of water. Jesus, let them perish. Holy let them Spirit, perish. Let them my perish. God and my Savior, and in the power, we have changed up the water. Begin to perish. Begin to perish. Begin to perish. Begin to perish. In the name of Jesus, yes, I command God. you to perish. In the name of Jesus, you are multiplying yourself because of me. Multiplying yourself so that you can destroy my life. Oh, let them perish inside the water. when they say be fruitful and multiply and replenish the heart and subdue it and have dominion over the fish of the sea have dominion in whatever likeness whatever likeness you would that that that, that has uh uh partner to be a a a, a uh, an habitat of, of of that water and have and over the fowls of the air and over everything that moveth upon the air what did he say he said have dominion over them have dominion over them now where they now have their powers and they are using it against us it means they are def they are uh they are countering the plan of God for our life. And that is why we are calling the one that holds the universe. That's why we are calling the one that has power over them. That's why we are calling the maker of the heaven and the earth. He says, and have power over the fowls of the air, over the birds of the air. Now, let me tell you. I think I was explaining the last time that I was in a place where, where we discovered that enemy has taken over this place. So we begin to pray until we locate that enemy. Then we told the enemy, pack your load and leave this arena. By the time she packed her load to leave that arena, there was a deposit that was left behind. We do not even, we, we, we don't, uh, we were not moved by whatever is left behind. We continue praying until the Spirit of God directed us and said, Look at this thing. As a matter of fact, we were praying. And the Spirit said, You thought I have left. Okay. I am everywhere in this place. There is nothing you say that I don't hear. There is nothing you do that we don't see. So we begin to pray until we locate that property. So when we took that property, there are likelihood that she will come back for this property. So we took the property from that location and took it to another location. May I quickly tell you something? Where we put that property, once it is exactly 12 a.m., you will see all this board. I mean, I don't know if you have it in your country that has the black and the white in the middle, then the black. 
black, white, black, black, white. Then they will come, 12 a.m. They will now land on that place where that property is kept. So they will be going, they will be coming. They will be going, they will be coming. They will be going, they will be coming. And God directed us to that place that we prayed. And when prayer were made, that was the end of the appearance of that bird. <laughs> we are going to pray. Every power in the air meant to come and be picking my sweat, to be picking my struggle, to be picking my destiny. I command the thunder of heaven to slay them now. In the Amen. name of Jesus, please Amen. open your mouth. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, every power that lost in the air, my God, and all the seas to come and be picking. They pick your God, pick them one by one. They pick your hard work. They pick your reward. They pick your reward. Whatever it is that it is your struggle, this is how they pick them one by one. They pick them one by one. Struggle to keep my glory. My Lord and my Father, begin to eliminate. Let anger of God come upon them. In the name of Jesus, why are you suffering? Why God has given you dominion over them? Coming around the gathering because of you. This is how they will come themselves from this city to this city. And support to support. Some of them are even doing meeting in your house. Some of them are even doing meeting in the corner of your house. Or wherever they are. Let you fall on them. Oh, every power guarding against me. Guarding against me. Yes. The spirit of the Lord. Lord, I pray now that the fire will consume them. 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 Uh -huh. They don't sleep. This is how they will be flying. Once you begin prayer, the sound will increase. They are fitting on top of your roof. They are fitting on roofs on different platforms. My God and my Father, I release fire now. I release fire. Let the fire burn. Let the fire go burn. Let the fire go burn. Every power, every power that flies in the air that is not of God, meant to come and monitor me. Holy Ghost, let fire burn there. I destroy them in the name of Jesus. Lord, I pull them down. Lord, I pull them down. I pull them down. I destroy them. I scatter them. I dislodge them in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost, scatter them. Scatter them. Scatter them. Scatter them. Scatter them. Scatter them. Amen. Amen. It is a power, it's a very powerful verse that we need to claim ownership on because that verse is given to us. And God blessed them, and God said unto them, Be fruitful and multiply and replenish Have the hearts. Now he now understood that when 
men slept, his enemy came. When men slept, his enemy came. When people are multiplied over the head, yeah, the devil is angry. And the devil wants to take as many people, in fact, if possible, to take every people with him. He now said, this earth that you are multiplying, is replenish the earth and subdue it, and do what? And have dominion. Now, yeah. you know, <laughs> now those power, they exist in three different forms. After this three different form, there are no other form. As you are replenished the heart, look at it, there is the power of the fish. They carry the embodiment of a fish. Now, I have given you power to dominate them. Now, there are some that are the embodiment of a, a bird. And these people too, I want you to have dominion over them. The one that, that swim, have power over them. The one that fly, have power over them. And now, have power all over every living thing that moved upon the earth. As this spirit looks very simple, as they look very easy, they are more dangerous. They are more dangerous. Powers on the earth. We look at them, they look like us. They do not have on in their head. They have two arms like we have. They have two legs like we have. We reason together. Look at it. We even get married to them. My God. We even get back and then they possess them. So we live in the same house together. So we go to the same church together. So we claim to call the same name of Jesus together. We claim to fast together. We claim to have the same purpose of one mind together. But I tell you, they are very deceptive. Bible said the man, heart of a man is so weak, desperately wicked that no man can know it. Let me tell you something. If you are if you are beside the sea and you see a very big fish that you have never seen before, a subconsciousness will tell you maybe this is a demon. When you see a bird flying at odd hour, perhaps in the, the uh, perhaps dead in the night, and you see how big it looks like. And it's like a hole looking like you, happy like the same eyes you have. You will say, oh, I rebuke you, demon. But when you now see the one that looks like you, that we sleep on the same mattress together, we call ourselves partners. We do business together like we are one. But these are powers that are sent to come and destroy you. These are powers that have become an altar, taking over an assignment to hide that, destroy you, your children, anything that has to do with you that can frustrate you and bring you down. These are powers that moves upon the earth. And he has given us dominion over them. I tell you tonight, you will prevail over them. Amen. They want to take you to court. They want to drag your name in the mud. They want to, oh my God. We are praying together, but yet their plan is to kill you. We have planned to fast for 21 days. And we are fasted barely one week. And they brought food, food for you. They say by now you should be hungry. Have you forgotten the fast? Oh, okay. The fast. Yeah. We are going to pray. Wherever they are, in human form, sent to come and bring you down like they brought something down. Holy Ghost, expose them and disgrace them. Shall we open Amen. our mouth and pray? Expose Father, them and disgrace them. Father, 
any man or woman. These are spirit of Delilah. These are Jezebel incarnate. And they are meant to come and kill, to come and steal, and to come and destroy. Whoever they are, Holy Ghost expose them. 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 In the name of Jesus. But you pretend to be a friend of brother. As simple as they look like they are very dangerous, as simple as they seem, they are very terrible and very wicked. They are the man in desperate with wicked who can do it. The spirit of our Lord, we cannot do. Expose them. Expose them. Expose them. Expose them. In the name of Jesus. Begin to expose them and disgrace them. Every aspect, wherever they are functioning, Lord, expose them. Lord, that the progress is not moving. They are sitting down on that way. 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 Oh, my God. 
Amen. Father Lord, we thank you because you have given us <laughs> power to trap or trap upon scorpion, serpent, thank and they you, will Father. not hurt us. You have given us power over the sea. Yes, you have given us power yes, over the air, and you have given us yes, power over the land. Lord, I pray, yes. wherever they are making trouble, Lord, we subdue them in the name of Jesus. We Amen. destroy their mind in the name of Jesus. We Amen. destroy their mind in the name of Jesus. Amen. Whatever belongs to us that is in their hands, by the authority in the name of Jesus, I command now that it be released in the name of Jesus. Amen. Anyone Amen. in captivity of sickness, I command you be healed in the name of Jesus. Amen. Anyone Amen. in the captivity of failure, captivity of poverty, I command you, I command now that the uh, uh, the power to be rich will come upon you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Whatever Amen. calamity confronting you, facing you right now, I command peace be still. I command Amen. that God in heaven will step into your matter and begin to find alignment to your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank Amen. you, Father, because we know you have answered our prayers. Thank you, in Father. Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Two things I want us to do. Uh, our father is on the line. Why uh, 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 Pastor Udi? I think I called the name correct. You are right, sir. Okay. God bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, okay. Many of us have been following. Do not think that we do not follow uh, your, your hospitality when you are hospitalized. Uh, all your messages uh, that many of us did not reply does not mean we are not we are not following you, sir. We are really with you in spirit, and then all the leaders can uh, mm -hmm. attest to that. And then when you are released, I mean when you are discharged. We have been following everything, and I know by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, you are going to be permanently uh, perfect, health wise, financial wise, economically wise, in your family. All things you have been posting on the online, even about the children, do not think that we are not following. We are following. We are praying for you. And I pray by mm -hmm. the power and the blood. So Christ, free tree is your in Jesus' name. Uh, yeah. As a result of that, I want everyone yeah. to yeah. lift our force up for him. And then before Pastor Dabo come back to pray for him, that by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, that uh, prophet came to uh, Ezekiah, told him, this is what the Lord said. Ezekiah said, okay. I know you, you are just an ordinary woman being. 
God send you. And then do not forget, as you are a human being, uh, uh, ambassador of the Lord, I'm an ambassador of the Lord too. That thing you bring, that paper you bring, I tear into pieces. And let mm. me go to God myself. Let me take God, my own case myself. Let me see whatever uh, my own side of the story. Let me able to present it to God myself. You go back and see what God is going to do. And every one of us will see what God do, what God did. We now call upon the name of the Lord on behalf of our Father. Wherever devil may be terrorized him, wherever maybe may, devil may be terrorized his family, wherever devil may be terrorized his his financial situation, wherever maybe devil may want to show him that yet. Somebody called me recently and then he said something very, very important to me. For everyone for that we have been following some of my own case too, I want you to look at this. He said, in your old age, you will not serve us. And now I look at all what I've been passing through. I look at my age, truly. I look at his prayer. And now I was a little bit... uh. Uh, a test, comfort, I mean, comforted with what he has said. That I was thinking that, oh, this is what I've been losing, this is what I've been losing. But the way he look at it is different from the angle I've been looking at it. He said, in your old age, at this age, you will not suffer. We now call upon the name of the our Father, of, of, of Almighty God. We pray for Pastor, uh, for Daddy Woody, that by the power in the blood Lord, the rest of his life, he will use it in the joy of the Lord in the name of Jesus Christ. Let us Amen. Call, let us call upon the name of the Lord. I want you to open Amen. your mouth. I want you to pray for my him. This our daddy. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, I look at this picture today. Yes, yeah. I totally believe. Age is coming. But let's call upon the name of the Lord. Yes, in the name of Jesus Christ. Let us pray for him. 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 Let us pray for He's going to receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. He's going to receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. He's going to receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. He's going to receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You know, I'm so funny to some things. Many, many people may not know. I know I'm serving a living God. And then, ah, uh, by the grace of the Lord, this is not proud. This is not uh, making myself known. I know the way I talk to Almighty God. And then I don't believe that there's nothing God cannot do. And I only want to testify to people that I'm serving God. Do you know the God I'm serving? Do you know his name? His name is Jesus. And then, whenever challenges comes, uh, I kneel down. You know, by the time I close my eye, yes, I know I want to pray. By the time I say, oh, mighty Father, I know I'm going to be before the throne. By the time I kneel down, I know, yes, God knows that my son has come. Then, 
when those challenges continue, I don't want to prove to the people, you know, I have God. Then I don't stop. And I see that, okay, maybe this race is more than me. I now employ all the friends, all those people I know we are in the God family together. I don't shut up. Because until I see uh, the, 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 the answer of my prayer, I don't shut up. I will keep continuing to call upon the name of the Lord. And then, then when I see that this thing is beyond, I, I, I call upon the people. Then I remember telling Kenneth again. One of the things that concerns me, and I only learn about Kenneth again is this. Do you know what, God? I'm sick. And then, this is the reason. If you heal me, it doesn't change your name. You are still God. If you don't heal me, it doesn't change your name. You are still God. But you better heal me so that your name can be praised. Mm -hmm. Man. Then I look at our father. You know, there are some things I always tell us in this online. I don't see the reason why. Uh, uh, please pardon me for the language I want to use. Shouting, come on Saturday, come on Thursday, come on Monday, and you cannot show anything significant about it. What is that purpose of prayer? And then that's why I normally find it difficult to miss this prayer. Because anytime I miss it, it's like I miss something in my, in my, in my life. Why? I know God has a prayer. Then, I've seen this, our father, he has been going through a lot. The, the, now, we can't force God to do whatever he doesn't want to do. But one thing I know about him is this, he has a prayer. And either he, he does this or not, yes. people will see that. Yes, God answer your prayer. And I know I like I, I like using myself as a good example. I'm not as a prayer, please. It's not the best thing to use the Bible but for all of us that the pastor. But if you don't show people uh, the kind of the garment you have in your neck, how will they know they're going to answer your prayer? That's why a lot of things my people uh, went through with me. When I say my people, all the, all the pastors are online. Anytime, anywhere, anywhere I find myself, people always tell me, do you know God has mercy on you? Because what I've passed through, I will have gone. Forget it. They go to a somewhere. By the time they got there, the person tell them, who is this person? He has already dead. I'm serious. He has already dead. For what? I, so what, uh, what am I? I'm not trying to proud or something like that. What I'm trying to say is this. Father, we in this online, that's why that we are few. We know that you answer prayer. For many of us that have been following uh, Daddy Udi, we know that he has been passing through a lot, especially about leg. Yes, you may not know we are following. We are following. We now call upon the name of the Lord. Father, his life belongs unto you. And we come in adding our faith with his faith that there's nothing you cannot do. Yes, Lord. You know the best, O oh Lord. We pray by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ. The Father. mercy from heaven. We don't know how we want to do it. You are the creator of his life. He belongs yes, unto Lord. you. But let the mercy from heaven that people will know that his mercy is upon him. Let him fall upon him in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That the mercy from heaven, mercy from above, by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, fall upon your mercy from heaven. Let the mercy from heaven that the people will know that his mercy is upon him. Let him fall upon him in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, he is looking for us. As he can look for, by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, the mercy of the Lord, fall upon him in the name of Jesus Christ. The mercy of the Lord will fall upon our Father in the name of Jesus Christ. We will see the hand of the Lord. We will see the mercy 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 of the Lord. We will see
we pray for you papa that um the healing virtue from heaven will come upon you and your family Amen. In the Amen. name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. Amen. We pray Amen. that the heavens will be open on your behalf and the Lord will bless you and your family. Amen. Amen. Wherever your children are in blessing, the Lord will bless them. Amen. Amen. Door for them. Amen. That you will Amen. never lack anything good in your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 And so, Father, we pray for every person present online today that you will open the windows of heaven, bless everyone in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Lord, wherever there are demons, wherever there are enemies, I pray they will not subdue, they will not overcome, they will not overthrow any one of us in the name of Jesus. Amen. So power to Amen. Heal, power to triumph. Power to dominate over them, release unto us in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. As a parent, the Lord will bless you. Amen. He will bless your children Amen. in the name Amen. of Jesus. As Amen. a business Amen. person, the Lord will bless your business. Amen. In the name Amen. of Jesus, the Lord will Amen. give you promotion. He will elevate Amen. you in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. You will not Amen. Over, You will not beg for bread. In Amen. the name of Jesus, Amen. I pray, Lord, Amen. no persons here will be weak spiritually. Amen. No persons here will be Amen. weak physically. Amen. In the name of Amen. Jesus, Amen. Amen. Lord, Amen. this coming week, you will go ahead of us. Amen. And for the Amen. of the new month and this year and the year to come, Lord, Let's begin to receive favor on every side, open door on every side in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. No one will die before their time. No one Amen. will die young. No Amen. one will miss anybody in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Thank you, Father, because we know you have answered our prayers. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 God bless you. Amen. Thank you, sir. Uh, we welcome Pastor, Pastor Chris. Our time has gone because I know many people are going to work, uh, workers' meeting. Almighty God will be with us in Jesus' name. Thank you, Pastor Amen. Chris. Uh, uh, let's share the grace together. The grace of our Lord, the love of God, the love of God, and the fellowship of all Surely, goodness and mercy will follow us all the days of our lives. And we shall live in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen.
God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Uh, please, for many of us that know Sister Olubumi and other sister, please let us help me to get in touch with them that we didn't hear their voice. So we miss them. They are our mother online. We miss them. I think Pastor Ali will learn them very well. Thank you very much, sir. God bless you. Good night. We'll see you on the okay. garden of the people tomorrow. I'm online now, Pastor ah. Akomo. This is Sister Jiroti. Oh. My name is not sure, but I'm online. Oh. <laughs> God bless you, sir. Yes, sir. God bless you, sir. Sister, sister, too. But thank you, ma. Thank you. I saw your name. God will continue to be with you. Almighty God will reward you abundantly in Jesus' name. Amen. God do it in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Don't let me waste our time. Thank you. Thank you, sir. God bless you, sir. Yes, sir. God bless you, sir. Amen. I think we have shared the grace. <laughs> Thank you.